Hello, it has been quite some time. You are looking beautiful. This is beautiful too, but not as beautiful as you. So where have I been? Because I do apologize for my absence. In the past six weeks, I have gone from New York to LA, to New York to Spain, to New York to LA, to New York to LA, to Toronto, to New York, to LA, to New York, to Tel Aviv, to Amsterdam, to New York, and now Iceland. And that's in six weeks, and that's a lot. It's been a lot. I thought I could do it and be totally fine, but I gotta tell you, I've never, I've never hit my limit before. And that's been very interesting to, to kind of accept that there's a limit of things that I can do. Because I always want to do everything. People ask me to do things, to do talks, to go places, to explore. And I want to do everything. Why would you ever not want to do things? Why would you ever say no to anything? You say no to some things, kids, obviously, like riding panthers through volcanoes, you'll probably die. I kind of, I realized that I, I'm doing too much and it didn't allow me to do what I love, which is make videos. I didn't have time to make videos anymore. And especially because I don't, I don't know, maybe it's a personal thing, but I always want everything to be amazing or to be as good as I can possibly do it. So I could have just filmed my phone, but would it look like this? <laughs> no. And I, I want that. I want what I, what I share, an extension of me, which these are, to be the best because that's what I always expect for myself. You know, recently I made this video called Ghosts over on Vsauce 3, and, and that was one thing that I, I spent a lot of time on. I've been making less videos over on Vsauce recently because of traveling, and also I just invested a lot of time into that video. I've never worked with a crew before, so that was very interesting to, to direct them. I remember I, the day before we shot it, I was walking with a cinematographer, and I was just going through the set and trying to explain it as best I could. Be like, okay, so at this point I'm gonna be sitting on the couch holding a skull, and the camera's just gonna float. We're just gonna float through and just see me, you're gonna be like a ghost, like this being, this existential thing just moving. And I want it to feel natural and organic and just flow. And it was very interesting just kind of trying to explain how I think to another human being and hoping that they wouldn't think that I was weird. But even if they did, whatever. And I, I wanna do more of that, but then it puts you at a level, right? Where you have to do more. I want to make something better than that, personally. And, and that's a that's a tough a tough order because we make these things pretty quickly, you know But I still write and research and edit and host and direct every video and this one now generally what it is is I set up the camera and I hit record and there's a screen facing me so I can see myself going back to Saying yes to things and saying no to things. It's difficult to say no because you don't ever want to limit what you do and By saying yes, it allows me to see what I can actually do and what I can't do and when I can say That it's just too much and that's what's happened recently, where I've actually had to turn things down, which has been heartbreaking. Because I love doing things, but my priority is making videos. Making little movies, little stories, narratives. Even if it's explaining something like if we could live on the moon or about ghosts, it's a story. There's a narrative, I hope. A beginning and a middle and an end in some sort of form that we create together. And we go on a journey and we explore. You know? Just like Vikings through these glaciers. Breaking through them with their ships. BT dubs. Iceland is fantastic. I mean, look at it, man. This is incredible. And I got to see the Aurora and there's a Taco Bell here. So it's heaven, pretty much is what I'm trying to explain to you. It's fantastic. If you've been keeping up on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram, I posted photos of, of this trip and like of all the places I've been in the past six weeks. I mean, I've gone like 50,000 miles and it's not over yet. I still have about, about, oh, Toronto's rubbing off me. I still have like two more, two more places to go. And then back, back home to New York where I can actually make things again. And I can share things that are here and share them and that's exciting. I just wanted to talk. I just needed to talk. I haven't talked like this in a while, so this is good. And I really just wanted to share this behind me because, my goodness, holy crumbs, man. Holy crumbs. It is fantastic. We drove about six hours, my friend Vanessa and I. We drove like six hours to get here and boy was it worth it. It's just incredible. The world is so freaking incredible. And I'm glad that, that I get to share it with you and we can kind of check it out together. It's also freezing, by the way, like literally zero degrees Celsius. You can hear the ice breaking, moving, forming, becoming something different. <laughs> How freaking cool, man. What an amazing world. Anyway, thank you for listening to me ramble and go on probably 
some there's probably some tangents in there, but I'm just too cold to actually function. To see whatever everything else that I've been doing, there's a you can there's socials. Just there's the socials. They're down there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And remember, it's not goodbye. It's